All right, so let's talk about the epic event where heroes and aliens came together. Oh, I'm sorry, I thought, did you think I was talking about the CW Heroes vs. Aliens event? Oh, no, that was total bullshit. I'm talking about something good, I'm talking about Steven Universe. <laughs> um, yeah, so, quick, a quick thing real, um, I want to mention. I totally forgot this was going to be on today. I totally forgot this was going to be on, and I, <laughs> had it not been for my DVR reminding me, I would have totally missed this episode, and also The Real Manos, which we actually did the review right after the episode, and I think that might come out tonight or tomorrow on Geekvolution. For those who don't know, yeah, I do collaboration reviews with The Real Manos on Geekvolution. Uh, go check those out. Um, but yeah. <laughs> so this episode is Three Gems and a Baby which is, I guess you could say, the unofficial Christmas episode, kind of like how Gem Harvest was the unofficial Thanksgiving Day episode. Yeah. Um, this is also an episode that I've been kind of waiting for, and upon hearing the name, I knew one thing was going to happen. I knew this one moment was going to be uh, very prevalent in this episode. Um, that being Rose and her feelings towards Steven. Now, the story is, is that, um, the Gems and Greg and Steven are uh, basically uh, at home with, uh, and there's a blizzard going on, and Greg proceeds to tell Steven the first time there was a blizzard, and the it was several months after Rose's death and Steven's birth. So Greg is actually taking care of Steven on his own, and I'm going to say this, um, I think, <laughs> and this is just my personal feel, and my, my personal um, thoughts, you know, just my personal opinion. If it doesn't match with yours, that's totally fine. No ill will against you. I've, I'm just saying that Greg might be the best cartoon dad ever. <laughs> I'm just saying, like, Steven, I mean, you know, considering, you know, we've had characters like, um, you know, Homer Simpson, Peter Griffin, Timmy's dad. Yeah, Timmy's dad from Fairly Odd Parents. I guess the only one that comes close to being on the Greg level is probably Jack from Danny Phantom. You know, Jack Fenton. Um, and even then, he had his screw-ups. But yeah, Greg Universe is probably the best cartoon dad ever. But that's just me, though. So, yeah, we see that Greg did have some difficult times um, dealing with, you know, having Rose not there anymore. But, you know, he still had to look out for Steven. He still had to watch out for him and still take care of him because, yeah, he still, you know, that was still all he had left of Rose. The Gems um, don't exactly see it the same way because to them, they think Steven is either a fusion or Rose shapeshifted or Rose is trapped within Steven. They don't, because at this point, they don't know what Steven is. They think it's still Rose. And, uh, yeah, can we just talk about one thing that happened in here? Can we just talk about how Ro like Pearl was considering killing Steven? I mean, let's l let me just throw that out there. Ro you know it, I know it. If she had removed the gem, there's a good chance she would have killed Steven. Yeah, take that Christmas specials. Bet you never had. Uh, I bet you never had an episode where some where a baby nearly gets killed. Yeah. <laughs> let's see you do that, Charlie Brown Christmas, or how the or you know. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that just happened. And it wasn't out of malice either, even though Ro um, Pearl is still very clear. I, this is the big thing about this episode, was that it was very clear. I was very much looking forward to seeing how Pearl, most of all, would deal with Steven. And, of course, this is the months after Rose's death and Steven's birth. So her, most especially out of all the gems... Um, and seeing her reaction to Steven and her thoughts on him. And it's not out of malice, it's more like they just don't know any, the gems don't know any better. That's the big thing, is that they don't know exactly what, you know, what Steven is, and they're not angry about it. Well, Pearl, for the most part, isn't angry about it. Um, they just don't know and just think, oh, it must be, you know, like us, you know, what we can do. So let's try doing it our way by kidnapping Steven <laughs> and nearly killing him. But yeah, um, again, keep in mind, you know, what Pearl was about to do um, wasn't out of evil, you know, it wasn't to be evil to Steven. She just thought, oh, if I do this, then, you know, Rose will come back and, you know, <laughs> yeah, everything will be fine again. So, yeah, it's a nice little um, episode. It's a nice little one-and-done episode. The feels are still there because it is very clear that, um, you know, at this point, per and it's a nice little um, showing 
of back then of where Greg and the, and the gems were after Rose's death and where everyone, including Steven, is now. It's a nice little, um, it's a nice little contrast in this flashback. And, yeah, I really enjoyed that. I think this episode was, um... <laughs> I thought it was, um... <laughs> I thought it was a lot of fun. I thought this was, uh, very enjoyable. Um... Of course, the, fe the of course Rebecca Sugar um, consistently kicks us in the balls with feels. So, you know, but, but what else is new, right? <laughs> yeah, what else is new? <laughs> just Rebecca Sugar just coming along and just going whoosh, right to the ball of the your balls of feels or fetal balls. I don't know. I don't know where I was going with that. Never mind. <laughs> So, yeah, it's a pretty fun episode. It's a nice little unofficial Christmas episode, like I said, with um, Gem Harvest, which is a nice little um, unofficial uh, Thanksgiving Day episode. But, yeah, um, so you guys tell me, what did you guys think of this episode of Steven Universe? Did you guys like it? Did you guys hate it? Uh, just comment below, let me know. And, uh, yeah, also, we're probably going to go on another hiatus. This has been confirmed as the last episode of 2016. Not the end of the season, just the end of the year. Last episode of the year, so we're probably going to have to play the waiting game for a couple months, so hopefully that won't be too long. Anyway, once again, hope you all enjoyed this, and I will see you guys later.